Another child neglect case involving twin babies, this one's in Portsmouth. The investigation started earlier this month when a nine-month-old boy was admitted to Children's Hospital, the King's Daughters, with head injuries. Tuesday, Portsmouth police arrested the baby's parents, 24-year-old David Miller and 23-year-old Jessica Evans, and charged them with child neglect. Ten your side's Katie Collette joins us now with more. Katie? Nicole and Tom, when that nine-month-old arrived at CHKD earlier this month, the baby's head injuries prompted Child Protective Services and hospital staff to immediately call police, and an investigation began. That's when detectives say they discovered the baby's twin brother suffering from similar injuries. Investigators say the abuse happened in this Jewel Avenue home in Portsmouth. February 3rd, David Miller and Jessica Evans took their nine-month-old son Chase to CHKD after a family member noticed swelling in his head. Police say the baby's head injury appeared to be caused by abuse and through their investigation found Chase's twin brother Atreyu suffering from similar injuries. I don't know how anybody could do that to a child. The news shocks family friend and neighbor Franklin Vosdick. I just... I can't believe that they did. Fosdick says this dark sign of Miller and Evans just doesn't match the family he's known for years. Every time I seen him, everything was fine. I mean, the, they were David was always playing with his son. She was always playing with him. They was always happy. I, I never even seen him yell at their kid, yet alone, you know, raise their hand to him. In addition to Chase and Atreyu's head injuries, police say they found more evidence of abuse on the baby's bodies, but they won't go into detail. Miller and Evans arrested for the crime Tuesday. Fosdick saw police take them away. I thought it was all that, like a domestic squabble between husband and wife. You know, I see that all the time. I didn't know it was about the kids. I had no idea. We stopped by the family's home in the Hodges Manor neighborhood. Only the children's grandmother was there. She didn't want to speak on camera, but was very upset and said she's trying to get custody of the children who are with Child Protective Services right now. Miller and Evans are both out on bond. Miller's hearing is scheduled for the beginning of April, while Evans's arraignment is scheduled for next Wednesday. Katie Collette, 10 on your side.